Hello students, welcome back to Friend for Learning. Today, our lesson is about dissolving materials in water. We are going to do an experiment, do the predictions and observations, and we are going to record our results in our worksheet. Okay? I want you to get familiarized with these terms, dissolve. Dissolve means to disperse or disappear. Again, I repeat, dissolve. Dissolve means to disperse or disappear. Prediction, to guess. Again, I repeat, prediction, to guess. That is, you guess what will happen in the experiment before you come to the conclusion or the result. Okay? Observation, to observe, means you are going to watch the experiment very keenly, closely, and note down the point as the experiment takes place. And also, note down the result, what happened in the experiment. And what was the conclusion? So now I'm going to show you an experiment on dissolving. So as I'm going to do this experiment, I want you to make prediction along with me to find out whether these materials will dissolve or not and write your predictions in your activity book and after prediction we will see what really happens as the experiment goes on and i want you to put your final observation what you observe in this experiment in this activity book you can see there are two columns Okay, one is for prediction, another is for observation. Okay, let's get started. So here are some of the materials which I'm going to experiment with. The first is sugar. Okay. Next is rice. Okay. Then pepper balls. Okay. Then tea powder okay then food color okay then coffee powder okay and finally i have some salt okay to keep my experiment fair i'm going to fill these empty glasses with equal quantity of water So you can see I have taken equal quantity of water in all my glasses. Also my water is at room temperature. I want you also to take the equal quantity of water to keep your experiment fair. Now I am going to put quarter teaspoon of these materials into each of these glasses. First a quarter teaspoon of salt quarter teaspoon of food color, quarter teaspoon of pepper, quarter teaspoon of coffee powder, quarter teaspoon of tea powder, quarter teaspoon of rice, quarter teaspoon of sugar. Now I am going to stir all these ingredients very well. I want you to mix all this very well. Now I want you to refer back to your worksheet. Okay, we are going to fill in all the materials. We have used this for experiment like salt, food color, pepper balls, coffee powder, tea powder, rice and sugar. Now, before we reach the results, I want you to put your thinking caps and work like scientists to predict what would have happened which materials will mix which materials will not if you want to take time you can pause the video here and think about your answers 
what will be your predictions now i want you to refer back to your worksheet and go to the prediction column and put your predictions there like i have shown you an example here for the salt i feel the salt dissolved completely so i have put s predictions are nothing but your opinions before you end up with the results okay so i want you to go and put your predictions in this column now look at the third column it is for recording the final results the results which we obtained from this experiment now we will look at the final results of all the material now first we are looking at salt it dissolved completely i don't see any particle of the salt in the glass so i feel the salt has dissolved completely now now we are looking at the food color i don't see any particles in it it's completely dissolved okay so the final result is the food color dissolves i come to the pepper balls i can see still the pepper balls are there after stirring it very hard so we come to the conclusion that pepper balls do not dissolve now the next material is coffee you can see the coffee is completely dissolved it's actually an extract of coffee it's completely dissolved and also the color of the water is changed because some of the materials when they spread they change the color of the water they are mixed in now the next interesting in uh, material we come here is the tea powder okay when we mix the tea powder we can see that the extract has come out of the tea powder uh, but the i can still see yes i can see the particles are still in there it's not completely dissolved because the tea powder doesn't dissolve in water but we can see the color of the water has changed because it has given out its extract okay the next material we see here is rice and you can see still the particles of rice are in the base of this so it is not dissolved and finally we come to sugar you can see there are no particles of sugar left and it has completely dissolved now i want you to go back to your worksheet and the activity book and write your observation there i have done one for you we just noticed that the salt dissolved in water so i have written yes here and also my prediction was yes so uh, you can see that it matched with my result yeah so i want you to do this experiment at home using the available resources at home and write your results in these uh, columns and submit your results to me okay thanks for watching friend for learning and thanks for being with me take care bye